Celestial navigation also known as astro-navigation is the ancient art and science of position fixing that enables a navigator to transition through a space without having to rely on estimated calculations or dead reckoning to know their position. Celestial navigation uses sights or angular measurements taken between a celestial body and the visible horizon. The sun is most commonly used, but navigators can also use the moon, a planet or one of 57 navigational stars whose coordinates are tabulated in the nautical almanac and their almanacs. Celestial navigation is the use of angular measurements between celestial bodies and the visible horizon to locate one's position on the globe, on land as well as at sea. At a given time, any celestial body is located directly over one point on the Earth's surface. The latitude and longitude of that point is known as the celestial body as geographic position, the location of which can be determined from tables in the nautical or air almanac for that year. The measured angle between the celestial body and the visible horizon is directly related to the distance between the celestial body's GP and the observer's position. After some computations, referred to as sight reduction, this measurement is used to plot a line of position on a navigational chart or plotting worksheet, the observer's position being somewhere on that line. Sights on two celestial bodies give two such lines on the chart intersecting at the observer's position. Most navigators will use sights of three to five stars if they're available, since that will result in only one common intersection and minimize the chance for error. That premise is the basis for the most commonly used method of celestial navigation and is referred to as the altitude intercept method. Thank you for watching. For more educational videos, please subscribe to WizScience on YouTube or visit wizscience.com.